Good evening. Thank you for joining me. I'm Craig Smith, the deacon at St. Stephen's Episcopal Church. As we come together for the Order of Compline, I can't help but to reflect this night of the many ways that each of us are trying to adapt to a new rhythm in our lives. God has a way in times like this of helping us just stop and reflect. And out of this, the little things in life we never think about become more meaningful. Feeling our heartbeat, our lungs inhaling and exhaling, as we recognize and feel life beating and breathing within our bodies, we can also feel a love that is beyond our understanding, residing in our soul. Perhaps this time has become for us a Sabbath time, a time to rest, a time to reflect, a time to listen, a time to be still a time just to be, a time to let God touch us with the gift of his spirit and recognition of eternal life. This is a time of refuge for each of us, for we can remember what Jesus has told us. Make your home in me as I make my home in you. Service of Compline begins on page 127 of the Book of Common Prayer. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault in thought and word and deed and in what we have left undone for the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive us all our offenses and grant that we may serve you in newness of life to the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Let us read together Psalm 134. Behold now, bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, that you stand by night in the house of the Lord, lift up your hands in the holy place and bless the Lord, the Lord who made heaven and earth bless you out of Zion. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us, a reading from Peter. Be somber, be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion seeking someone to devour. Resist him, firm in your faith. Thanks be to God. 
Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer and let your cry come to you. Let us pray. Visit this place, O Lord, and drive far from it all snares of the enemy. Let your holy angels dwell with us to preserve us in peace. And let your blessings be upon us always, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. O oh God, your unfailing providence sustains the world we live in and the life we live. Watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep and grant that we may never forget that our common life depend on each other's toil. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. We lift up to you this night, dear Lord, the following members of St. Stephen's Episcopal Church. Robin and Jennifer. Shirley, Maggie, Eric and Jeremy, Edie and Martha, Betsy and Missy. Almighty and eternal God, ruler of all things in heaven and earth, mercifully accept the prayers of your people everywhere and strengthen each of us to do your will through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning is now and will be forever. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God, the almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Bless us and keep us. Amen.